Hey, what's up guys, it's Strategy is Destiny, and welcome to my Remnant from the Ashes Hunter Damage build. This build may not be the best for the Hunter class in everyone's opinion, but in, in my opinion it is. So first I'll talk about the gear. So for the weapons I chose the Sniper Rifle, because even though it has a slow firing rate, it deals a lot of damage, especially in the weak spots, which is what my build revolves around. Next, I chose the repeater pistol, because if the sniper rifle doesn't finish off an enemy, the pistol can quickly finish off that enemy because of its fast firing rate. Next, I chose the Menda, Mender's Aura weapon mod, because it, maxim, because it allows me to have more healing at my disposal, and I can survive for longer. I also chose the Hotshot weapon mod because it maximizes damage output with 20% increased damage and the shots burn enemies as well. I chose the Ribbon Melee weapon because it maximizes damage output with 20%. I mean because it, the, its leech passive ability allows me to survive for longer. I chose the Hunter Armor set that you start out with in the beginning because it gives me 25% increased weak spot damage with the three pieces worn as shown. I also chose the Galenic Charm for my necklace because it allows me to generate my weapon mods a lot faster and I chose the Hunter's Band because it further increases my weak spot damage by another 25% for enemies. Uh, farther than 15 meters away and finally for the gear I chose the gravity stone because if there are at least three enemies closing in on me I can use my melee attacks to clear them out and leech life in the process so now that we're done that guys let us move on to the final part which is the traits but I just want to tell you guys in advance to not look at the traits I have at the moment because most of my traits that I chose unfortunately don't match this build. Alright so let's get started. First of all, no matter what class you're playing, max out Vigor and Endurance. The traits you want to focus on this build are Exploiter which increases weak spot damage, Executioner which increases your critical hit chance bonus, and finally you want to choose the mind's eye which increases range damage in order to maximize your total damage output so i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to leave any comments on what you thought of this build but any hateful comments um will be removed immediately leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe for more videos bottom right hand corner or top left to right and corner over here and click on the bell so you guys don't miss out on future videos and as always guys I will see all of you in the next one